Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I thought I'd go over my monthly favorites for March. Um, I know it's currently April, so I am a little late to upload this, so please forgive me, but I definitely do wanna go over some of the products that I was enjoying in March um, and just give you a little bit of information about them. Uh, before we get into the video, if you can go ahead and hit the subscribe button, ring the bell, and make sure to give this video a thumbs up, I would really appreciate it. Um, so let's go ahead and dive in. Um, as I mentioned, I just have a couple products. So to start off, um, start off, I'm gonna go over the skincare item, uh, which is by The Ordinary. This is their caffeine solution. Um, this is for underneath the eyes. Um, it definitely helps with deep puffing as well as dark circles. Now, when I first started using this product, I definitely saw immediate results in the deep puffiness. Um, I really enjoy that just because I don't get a lot of sleep. I'm a night owl um, and I do get up for work pretty early. Um, so I do have a little bit of puffiness and dark circles. Um, with the dark circle aspect, it does help. You just have to use it consistently so that you can see those results. Um, but I do recommend this. They sell it at Ulta and Sephora and it is pretty affordable. So I really like that about them. Um, the Ordinary does have some really affordable products and they are very, very good products as well. Um, but as I mentioned, I use this mainly underneath my eyes. Well, mainly it is for underneath the eyes. That's what it's for. Um, I usually just use this at night, not in the morning. In the morning, I use another product that targets more for wrinkles underneath the eyes. But this is something that I've been enjoying a lot through the month of March. Um, and I would keep using this, I think, probably for the rest of my life. It's something that I do enjoy and I recommend it to all of my friends. Um, but definitely check this out. Let me know what you think. Um, the next product is going to be more on the makeup side while well, the rest of the products are. Um, recently, uh, as you guys know, I've been stuck inside the house just like everybody else. Um, so I haven't worn a ton of makeup, but I do wear foundation pretty often around the house, even if it's just to cover up some of my problematic areas and something that I've been enjoying a lot is the Fenty Pro Filter Foundation. Love this foundation. I can't explain how good it is. Um, it is medium to full coverage. You can definitely build it up um, and it's definitely on the soft matte side, um, which I love a matte foundation. As I mentioned before, my skin is very oily and this just helps with that a lot. Um, I grabbed two different shades just because I suck at matching my skin tone. Um, so I have 310 and then I have 360. Um, I don't know, I thought one of them was gonna be my summer shade, the other one's gonna be my winter shade, but they don't really, you know, look like my skin tone, so I just mix them and it's what I have on right now and I think it gives me a pretty good match but I could be completely wrong. Uh, but this is a great foundation. You can get that at Sephora. Um, you know, Riri came out with a bunch of shades to target all skin tones, which I really love. And she just has some, uh, some great products. So I would highly recommend check out the brand and let me know which product you love by them or if you have the foundation, what does it do for you? Do you enjoy it? Do you hate it? Let me know. Um, the next product is gonna be highlighter. Now, as you guys know, I am a big fan of highlight. This is the one that I haven't been able to put down. Um, it's the Milk Cosmetics. Um, this is their Flex Highlighter. I have two shades. I have Glistened, I think that's how you pronounce it, and then Lit. Now, Lit is more on the icy side. Um, it's definitely more of a I don't know, icy shade is what I would kind of describe it as. Um, this I just put at the very, very top of my highlight, as you can see right up here. Um, and then Blissant is what I use kind of just to place everywhere else. Now this one is more peachy champagne. Um, it's definitely super, super glossy and gives you that wet look that I really enjoy. Um, and I will do some swatches so you guys can see what it looks like. So this is Blissened. You guys can see it, it's super. I don't know if my camera's gonna pick that up. I suck at this. And then I'll do Lit. I really enjoy Lit. I think it's super, super pretty. So Lit is the one underneath and then Blissened 
is on top over here. I definitely think you guys should check these highlighters out. Um, they don't give me any texture or anything like that, so I really enjoy this. Um, and you can get this at Sephora as well. The next product that I have for you guys is something that um, I bought when it first came out and I just haven't been able to put it down. This is the So Jaded palette from ColourPop um, and Kathleen Lights. This palette is amazing, so you guys definitely need to get this. Um, I love all the tones in here. This is frequent. This is something that I frequently use and is what I have on my eyes. Um, every product that I mentioned besides the skincare area is what is, what is on my face right now. So definitely check this out. Look at all the colors that we have right here. This is just gorgeous. Now, you can definitely create some amazing looks with this or if you want to stay more on the neutral side you can definitely do this um i just love this so much i get so inspired every time i see a look online with this and just when i look at it i know you can create different looks so i really love this palette i think kathleen did a fantastic job with this and overall colourpop just has fantastic palettes um their formula is amazing so i definitely think you guys should check this out um and let me know what you think about it the next item is a lip liner that I have not been able to put down. Um, I know you guys, met, well, you probably heard that I enjoy the Sweet Tea Lip Liner from Morphe. That is one of the best lip liners ever and it's super affordable. Um, but this one is Coconut by Kylie Cosmetics. Now, this shade is just amazing. At first, I didn't think I would like it, but it's definitely super, super um pretty and I think it's going to suit a lot of people so I'll definitely swatch it for you guys so that you can see what it looks like. Just like a perfect brown, um, it goes with a lot of the lips that I use um, so I definitely think you guys should check this out. I did buy a bunch of these when she had that like $5 sale going on. I stocked up and I am obsessed. This is one of the lip liners that I'll be using for the rest of my life. Definitely check this out. The last product that I have for you guys is the lip gloss that I have on. Now, this is one of the best formulas that I have tried in lip gloss ever. Um, it doesn't have the name lip gloss on it, so I might be wrong, but this is the Patrick Ta Lip Shine. Hopefully my camera will pick this up. Um, best formula ever it's not gritty not sticky and it gives you just that glossy finish this in, is in the shade she's expensive and i know he has other colors um i think the one that i really like is oh sorry i think i said the wrong name she's an influencer um the one that i like also is more of a champagne color she's expensive um definitely check that one out as well but definitely check this out patrick set has some great formula um his highlighter is pretty bomb as well um so let me give you guys a swatch i'm gonna do it just on my arm it's so glossy i don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see that No. Well, let me just apply more. Definitely check this out because I think he has a great formula. His lip liners are really amazing as well. Um, he doesn't have a variety of shades, which I hope he gets to extend because I just love his products. His fan is also pretty nice. Um, so make sure you guys check that out. Check out all the products that I mentioned. If you have them, definitely let me know what you guys think about them. Um, I definitely want to see what you guys think about the products that I mentioned. Um, but before I let you go, you guys definitely follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat. Let me see the looks that you guys create so that we can inspire each other. Um, but those are all the products that I have for you guys. Um, definitely let me know what type of video you want to see in the future. I am definitely open for options. But thank you so much for tuning in. I had a great time just going over the products. And I will see you guys in the next time. Bye guys. Have a great day.